If you open newspapers, magazines, you can set a lot of role model here. Very young guy just graduated from school for a few years and set their own company. Many factors here. Uh, number one is competition, because you know the, we have the huge population and the huge school population. So from private preschool, even from preschool to all the way to universities, the uh, the capacity of how we call the, the university's top of pyramid. So not everyone have this access. You see the, the, the ratio is 20, 21%, 21%. So you have to work very hard, even early from preschool, primary school. You have, you have to work, work hard, you have to do your best, and then keep the rank very high, and then you have the chance to go to the best school, and then you can go all your ways to the high university. That's the, that's the expectation from family, from the society, from the school, from your teachers. And that's the reality. We cannot, even we, the higher education expansion so quickly, but we still have limited capacity for very best students. So the intensive capacity. And the other one is culture. So in China, all parents, everyone hope your child can, can go all the way to the higher education. This may be our culture, this is our value. The employment is so tough in China. Uh, almost one third of graduates from university cannot find a job. So government and the whole society try to create this, try to create this environment, advancement, try to help them to set up their business. You know, for each university, we have this kind of office to help students, yeah, to, to, pro to provide this kind of training, this program, give them some, uh, give them some knowledge. You know, we have uh, uh, the youth, we have an organization, it's also an NGO they're called Youth Foundation. They set up this program, I know, in the past uh, uh, two years. It's very popular, it's very so welcomed by the youth, by the young students in universities. So it's a very well-designed program and then give them whole lectures and give them some opportunity to try to help them to set business plan and how to put it to practice and then arrange a mentor for them. So it's very popular in the universities. So government try to help them to and they also you can if you open newspapers, magazines, you can set a lot of role model here. Very young guy just graduated from school for a few years and set their own company. A lot of them through website, some business concern for the IT area. But that's the role model for use, for this very uh, model use. Some program is organized by the Ministry of Education or NGO or other institutions. And like World Bank, we also have this kind of uh, small fund to support uh, this kind of activities, innovations. Like uh, maybe just last year, we have a big pro program, big campaign. We call it China Development Marketplace. We mobilize money from this big multinational uh, enterprises, and then we we call for proposals for 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 the whole society. A lot of NGOs and even youth uh, students come here to send proposals, and then we give this uh, small grant to encourage them to do their business.